platinum and palladium, we do see upside for a, for a simple mine economics perspective. You know, we cannot cut into the cost curve forever. Um, at some stage, supply or demand will catch up with, demand, uh, with supply. However, there's inventories around, and that's why we think that platinum will struggle to move on a sustainable basis for at least another 12 months above 1,500, because um, we need to work through that inventories. Palladium, obviously, in the court, palladium a bit more upside. We do have all the supply issues. Russia, market very worried about it. Currently, you've probably heard that um, us and the competitor um, has launched palladium ETFs in South Africa uh, three weeks ago. Good uptake there, uh, which takes out even more inventory out of the market. And that's why we think palladium possibly better supported. We lost around about 400,000 ounces platinum, roughly, in the exact numbers is in the report, um, roughly 215 I think, ounces of palladium up to the end of Q1. Um, the longer the strike extend, obviously, the larger our forecast the deficit. But using what we know, we think that we're going to be in a deficit of around about 815,000 ounces. That's big deficit. If the mine strikes end, then we think next year we'll be still in a deficit, but slightly smaller, which implies we're drawing down on inventories, um, which is obviously positive from a price perspective. Um, this is just palladium, um, much greater deficits. And that's because the growth markets are in US and China. Those are the two palladium markets. And they are really growing quite well. However, you can see that we still think there's quite a lot of inventory around. And that's why we think the price is not reacting. Um, but because we forecast deficits, we do think we will move lower. But for now, we can work through it. And to us, it becomes a function at what price does the holders of metal uh, let go of their metal. It's there. It just needs to come to the market. And it's a price, a question of clearing. It's not a question for us that will run out of um, platinum. And palladium, a much more aggressive drawdown um, to around about 6, 000, uh, 6 million ounces uh, by 2019. And what is quite bullish for us in terms of palladium, it's not bullish yet, but if things don't change in terms of either substitution um, in the AutoCAD or more supply, recycling, for example, coming online. Um, in terms of ounces, we will be close to the levels that we've been in 2001, where the price was at $1,000 an ounce.